Hey guys, this is the elevator trim stall. It's one of the demonstrated stalls that your CFI is going to show you um, as you get through your uh, usually private pilot training. Now that stall will show you what the plane will do once you apply full power on a go around. So we're going to reduce our power back to 1500. We're going to reduce our airspeed down to 65, lower the flaps as we get slower. Once again, below 110 flaps 10, below 85 flaps 30. Once we get to 65 knots, we're going to pitch down a little bit, idle the power, and maintain a 65 knot descent by trimming the plane. Once we trim the plane, we're going to increase the power to full power without touching the yoke. And then you're going to see as the airspeed increases and the power increases, the nose will just rise up until we stall. Now the simulator doesn't simulate it as good in terms of aerodynamics, and the real plane you're going to feel once you add full power, the nose will just shoot up. Um, and it's going to be very hard to control the plane. That's why when you go around, you, you always feel as if you're pushing the plane down uh, or fighting the plane uh, as the nose wants to go up. Now, if you don't do anything, the plane will just stall. Uh, and, of course, in that instance, it will stall very close to the ground uh, once you initiate the, uh, the go around. So, once again, this is a demonstrated stall. Your CFI is going to show you that just to teach you what, will ha what can happen if you're not careful on the go around. This is it for today and see you guys next time.